Hello everyone and welcome back to another part of Let's Play Doppelganger Dawn of the Inverted Souls. Uh, last time we... Uh, let's just check because it's been a little bit. Tomorrow bonds. Yeah, we finished two endings of the many many more we have to do. It's getting really interesting. And right now we will continue with making other decisions because... Um, there are still two more endings and you said that there are definitely a lot darker endings and I just had a lot of luck to have gotten on my first playthrough a really good one and I'm really grateful for that because I think right now it will going it will be going down it will going to start going to a dark direction right now so without further ado let's okay now I first have to see what okay options 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 I think one of the good options is here. Um, this is an option that I really considered before already. It's the one where we can't, uh, like, we won't trust her, and this is why she won't like help us. And just in case you didn't know, I'm I wasn't recording for a while because I had some meetings I had to attend to, like uh, I had some, I prepared something and I had to talk about something like. Yeah, just in case if you were wondering why I didn't record anything. I just had some things to do and didn't have the time to record the last days. But right now I'm back into business and let's continue this. So, uh, right now we will not trust her and see what this will lead us to. No, I can't trust her. I just met her and she's acting suspicious. That's a way to see it. Oh well, I should just talk to her about random things. So how are things going? Fine. Still working on the novel. That's good to hear. I'll... Uh, I still don't know what this is. <laughs> God damn it. Go ahead, I'm curious to who her husband might... Okay, this is what we already saw. I remember that. Uh, okay. Let's just continue. Uh, hey, what are you doing here? Oh. Oh, 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 okay. Wait, 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 wait. Menu. Yes. Let's... I don't know. Um, because I was sure... I'm sorry that I just kind of interrupted it. I'm sorry that it just turned out like this, but I will just leave it in the video. I mean, mistakes are made and... I think I'll be like, here, I have to go back to this place where June shouldn't come. And we will now continue this because I already saw it in the last thing. <laughs> I'll just skip it, like usual. And what I wanted to do was not letting June come and not, l or not telling... Um, Oh. oh yeah, we are with Lee again. Oh man, hope he's okay. But the thing is, now that I see him, they mentioned Lee was apparently the one who's supposed to ass assassinate uh, Yuri, wasn't he? Assassinate him. Was it because of the stone? Because I think his family is kind of involved in it because of stone and things like that. And... Oh man. Extremely awkward. <laughs> oh man. Oh yep. Yep, yep. Oh man. I really don't know what to do about this. I'm sorry if I'm a little bit quiet. I'm just trying to think about in my mind how this all is connected. Like, yep. Like, how the hell and why is his family connected and how is he? Because I think Lee isn't exactly doing anything like maybe, I don't know, maybe some of his family 
some of the business, like assassination and stuff, maybe, but no, I think it has, it's more something personal for Lee, because Lee, definitely because he f uh, found out, I think June told, after she told us that she confessed to him and he told her that he likes uh, Lucia, so definitely we know he likes her, he likes Lucia, and I think it's more like he does personal He's more personal about everything because everyone involved, I mean, Senior Rafael involved right now, and stuff like that. I think it's. Oh man. Because everyone, everyone who's so far involved with anything connected to Lee has some kind of like relation with Lucia. For example, Yuri, Rafael, both guys with. Uh, Lee has been cautious of, or at least where he could have been like all... I'm really sorry, I'm just... Um, it's been a while and, it's, and it's, I really have to wrap my head around everything. No, oh, she's so bad for her ball. Oh man. I really feel bad for Lucia because of I think because of a stupid thing I did before where I went to Senior Rafael instead of Lee and because of I think this is the reason why he died or that happened to him at least I can't think of anything else this is the only t because I already thought it's pretty weird how the game let me decide to whom I want to go I thought it was more like oh yeah I can choose which guy I want no, it's more like something a lot, you know, it's something a lot more important. It has a huge story developing point. So it does make sense and it's, uh, it's kind of frustrating. It really feels like you can just decide, of, decide the fate of the characters in this game. So... Oh man. Okay. Okay. I wonder. Oh man, this is again this choice. Did I already like save this point? Yeah, I did. God damn it! Why didn't I just go there? <laughs> okay, no, we don't. Uh, let's just let's just say yeah. I think for. Okay, wait a second. I think we had here this one, right? Let's just load right here. Old safer, yes. I think that's it. I wonder what he was like back then, and he should probably stay like this to avoid judge. Okay, yes. I will just I will say this, even though it's really contradictory. I really don't want to do this, but it's important to the next ending. Oh, ah! Wait a second. I'll just load it again because I forgot to <laughs> read this. Okay, he should probably stay like this to avoid being judged by his friends. Alright. He should probably stay like this and act manly so he doesn't get judged. I mean, if he started acting more feminine, I think he'll be he'll get bullied. Me? <laughs> Meh. I know m how mean high schoolers can be. Hmm? Oh yeah. Yep. Yep. Now it's time to get awkward. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Uh -huh. Yep. <laughs> it's really interesting how he says you, me. <laughs> yep. Absolutely awkward. Okay. Let's just see how this will change everything. Oh man. I really wonder about Lee. I really do. I really want to get more. I want to know how this all is connected. Especially the thing with a phone booth at the end. I really think so. I really think what it has the phone booth has to do with anything. Because I think the phone booth we mentioned it sometimes, so I wonder if it's okay to skip. Err Oh god. <laughs> 
Okay. Because it's really skipping a lot faster than I thought. Okay, hopefully... Hopefully it will be correct. Just skipping everything and thinking what to do. And I wonder what his deal is. Like this guy's deal. We still don't know his name! This is really bothering me. Man. The little brother and stuff. Alright, now this is the point. Like, this is, um. Okay, let's now say I can't trust her and see where this will go. She's acting suspicious we're just talking about random things and then we already read this. And let's see, thoughts of senior... Oh, I really feel bad about it. I wonder... I wonder if she can actually get together with senior Rafael somehow. A morning phone call? Hey, can I talk to you for a moment? Sure, what is it? Okay, I think we already mentioned this. We already know this. I have doppelganger. <laughs> oh man. Okay. God damn it, with Rico. Hey. Okay, what are you doing here? Nothing. Perfect said. Okay. For people like your scum of society. Mind your own business. I think we already read this. Ain't my problem. Place Slayer. This makes sense. If he's saying about something like a slayer, and if it is maybe Lee, because we already knew that June said something that Lee tried was with him, so we assume that Lee is the, ass the assassinate, the, um, the one who's trying to assassinate the people with doppelgangers, but Lee is like. Now that I think about it, he always said stuff like don't go outside and keep yourself safe. I think in the prologue was it, right? When we spent time and then I think Clifford appeared and stuff like that. I think he already... I think he doesn't want to like... It makes sense now that he's saying it, because I was pretty confused about that. But now that we have a clue who it might be, and if it is Lee, it makes sense that he wouldn't want to kill Lucia. It makes a lot of sense, now that I think about it. <laughs> and what, what is it about for last wish? God damn it. Couple of fine, a couple of things, so someone sent someone else to kill me. You believe him. What? Yeah, yeah, right, the assassin left immediately. The thing is a little bit unlogical. Uh, like, it's not. He was called, but you knew him. Okay, but the thing is, in this like in this path right now, he already saw like Lee. Doesn't he recognize him, or was he just was it too dark and too weird and stuff like that? Okay, I think this is a little bit important. Do you think that manly version of me will work better in our society? Yes, probably. To fit into the room norms of society, you should be more like them. Yep. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I get it. That makes sense. After Yuri went home, I decided to call... Okay. I think it was important, this decision before what he made. So, let's see. What's up? Lee. Yeah, it was Lee. God damn it. Yeah, and Lucia is also like, hmm? Lee? It was Lee who was sent to kill Yuri. This is just... 
Yeah, this is kinda really weird. Very too fine. Take care of Yuri for me. He's a boy. Yep. Junings up and just blankly stared at my cell phone. What did she say? Hey you. Oh whoa, 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 whoa. That's interesting. Yep, let's see. Let's see where this will go. Hey you. Yuri is standing face to face with the face of his doppelganger. He still finds it hard to believe that the copy on self performing was intently but he's somewhat into the world. Yet as Yuri as Yuri looks at the reflection of himself smirking at him, he reflects on what Lucia had told him, yep, because this is what I was thinking. It took him quite some time to fully think he he her words over, but he has reached a conclusion he wholeheartedly believes in. Yep. No one could ever accept him for who he is. Oh my god. This is exactly what I feared and this is probably the other ending. He feels so utterly defeated by it all. The bullying living the bullying living a double life. How can Yuri possibly be a better person if he is always unable to be himself without the pressure of meeting certain expectations? For Yuri there's only one option left for him. Yep, it's me. <laughs> what do you want, boy? <laughs> You're finally gonna admit that I'm seriously a better man than you'll ever be. Yuri stares at this doppelganger for some time. He looks almost exactly like him, but if people looked closely they can definitely see the difference. The doppelganger has an Adam's apple, his facial features appear to be more masculine as well as his overall physique. Yuri pays close attention to the doppelganger's broader shoulders and tall stature. Yep, he is a tad bit taller than you. The person standing before him is how he always wanted to be. Yes, please. Take over my body. Oh no. Oh, this is not a good ending. I'm tired of this pathetic life, Elite. I just want to know if it was go if it was going to be better for me if I were like you are. Ha! Is that so? Well I don't mind if I do. <laughs> well don't mind if I do. <laughs> Please, just promise me that you'll take care of June for me, okay? Oh my god, no! Before Yuri stops the gang and fully takes over Yuri's real body, he slowly licks his lips like a cat. Oh, I'll be sure that she's well taken care of. Oh no! No, June's father repeatedly called me over and over yesterday. Yesterday was an utter mess. We went looking everywhere for her, but she just managed to know knows where. I'm sure that her disappearance was Yuri's doing it her ran off together. Yuri himself is nowhere to be found. Jun's and Ray Traver is searching for him like a bloodhound bolt. Oh. Everyone believes that Yuri was the person who kidnapped her, but I know better. I know that the real one is standing right beside me. Of me all. Oh. He's sobbing, his breath and c coming in gasps. The only noise I can hear clearly is his persistent wailing. What really happened to June and Yuri's doppelganger? I guess it's not my place to know. Yuri's path ending one. Giving up. <laughs> oh man. <sighs> the giving up ending. How beautiful, right? Not even, you know, not even the phone booth and nothing. Just like, just like that. Yeah, let's see the ending. Oh yeah, only the last one is left, and I have no clue how to. Okay, let's let's let's. Uh, okay, tomorrow was one. Let's see what what we can do. What we also can do. Let's see. I have an idea, but and I have a little bit of time left, so let's see if I can actually make it work. So I think it was right here. And I will tell him I wonder what he was like back then. And then I'm gonna go a little bit skip. Because, oh yeah, <laughs> a little bit awkward. Let's skip it a little bit. Because now it's uh, gotten a little bit longer. Okay. Hello, hi. And so, yeah. Okay. And now, oh man, 
I have to sneeze. I have to sneeze again. Ah, don't mind that. Okay. And now we will say that we can trust her, because last time, in the Bond's ending, she actually saved Yuri. But what will we do if we say if we tell her she, we can trust her so she doesn't know about it? And now we're gonna see where this will go. And now... Let's see. Okay, let's skip this. I think we already saw this. Oh, I feel so bad for him. Man, I know about Yuri and we will find out about this thing with Lee and... I really wonder. I hope it will... it is bad. I'm really sorry for all the skipping, but this is just... You know it will take forever if I will start to read everything and I really want to fight against... But as, lo as long as we lay low, nothing will happen, right? Okay. Let's see. They say when well and teachers are some please, that's a good thing, right? Yep. It tr truly is. You're just waiting for me at the school front gates, his eyes are downcast, but he looks terrified. Hey, why are you here? Have you found a way yet? I'm running out of time here. No, if I did, I would have called you. Damn it, we're both as good as that. <laughs> oh man, that's so reassuring. As Yuri says, that the both of us feel chills run down our spines. Yuri's mouth drops open in horror as he looks at someone standing behind my back. Oh, this is now new. This is interesting and new. Oh, what? I turn around and see that Lee is watching us. I don't know what he looks, what the looks on his eyes means. Oh. Please, Lee, don't look like that. This is so creepy. But one thing for sure, though, what Yuri is saying makes sense. I can't just feel it. We're dead. Gotcha. Yuri's path ending for God. What? <laughs> what the hell? What kind of ending was that? Oh. Central Park. Okay, now the phone booth again. Okay, let's see. Hey, what's up? I think it is actually the black dude talking, like the black clothed guy. <laughs> I know you won't believe any of us, Neil, but you know, sometimes you've got to believe that magic exists. I know this isn't over yet. I'll be fu- <laughs> What are you talking about? Okay, I'm coming home now. First case, corporate died. Or she only called stubble. Let's just call it a suicide. Second case culprit died. Enrico Moretti. That's all I can tell you. Her case culprit died. Rafael Martis. Cause of death. Suicide. Fourth case culprit died. Yuri Ivanov. Cause of death. Unknown. Pattern fits. Enrico's death ball. Did Zuyan seriously swing his sword over his head again? All the guys he killed had the same wounds. What? I see. Sorry to hear that. But that kid ain't listening to me. It's his own fault. Fifth case. I've no freaking idea. I know, I'll be careful. Okay. The fifth case and it's completely unknown? Something? What? He or she is still out there somewhere. The doppelganger craze isn't stopping anytime soon. Who exactly is behind this? I'm not too sure yet, but I do have a few guesses. <laughs> it could be you or me, who knows? I think now is a good time, let's see, that we... yep. Reverse lies. Giving up tomorrow bonds and got you. Okay, the got you ending was so goddamn disturbing. I don't even know what the hell happened. I know, okay, so he's fighting, like, okay, now it's completely, I'm completely sure that Lee is fighting. Like, he is the assassin who's killing the people with doppelgangers. And what my guess is right now, I will just look at the endings again, just in case. 
maybe I will remember something more. So giving up is definitely the one. So if you say the doppelganger can be only defeated, if you say you don't need him, the full acknowledgement that you never want the wish that you like spelled, you don't want it to be fulfilled because you're stronger than that. Or the thing about this crystal orb thingy from Lee's family, that is the one with bonds. This is the one overcoming it. This is the one giving up because if you give it up, you'll definitely get taken over by the uh, doppelganger. And like I think the soul is just like wandering around and no one will ever notice you like Clifford is. And got you is actually the one if you if if a thing like if a doppelganger doesn't take over your body, the assassin who is Lee will come and kill you because something about the organization that doesn't want to be found out. And I think it has something to do with this orb and everything and the orb was already stolen by this black clothed guy. Now the question is, what actually in the last ending, because Lee was there, Lucia also thought we were dead. But the thing is, and what the guy at the phone booth said, and what I'm thinking about is that okay, Yuri was got killed like everyone else with a sword by Lee. Makes sense. You can imagine that Sui is like carrying around a katana and killing people like that <laughs> if he is actually like hiding it somewhere. So kind of weird to say it and to think it. Oh. <laughs> And Lucia, I think he didn't really... I think because at the end he said, fifth case, I have no freaking idea. I think maybe Lee actually kidnapped Lucia? Maybe he like... It's a really weird thought, but I, I can't even imagine it in his state. Like, he is completely... This is just my assumption, but maybe he likes her so much that he doesn't want to kill her, but it's like taking her and like imprisoned her at his home and be like oh you're gonna be safe forever with me and something like that I know it's pretty young dead if you think about it like someone who's absolutely crazy of the other person because of love and stuff like that but it, I can't imagine it with Lee right now especially after what I just saw I mean the face oh that face though <laughs> don't want to see that again Okay, now we have definitely seen some things. Oh man. We still have so much more to see. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. I really wonder. Man, so many pages left to see. Okay. But what I will do right now is see which end, uh, which path I can go to next. Like, uh, see where the next path, uh, path is going to be. Because even though, even though we know it, the path is called Reverse Lies, I I wouldn't have ever figured out it would be Yuri. I mean, the death of the self-proclaimed god and the Crimson Tyrant and White Moon Remnants and Broken Crescendo. I mean, what the hell? This is too cryptic. I don't know who these people are. So. I will just see which path because I will like, well, <laughs> I will look right here in the loading screen because we only know here which path we are on. So I will like, how many do I have? Okay, no, I have only this much. Like we have still here a lot of things that we can do. God damn it. So um, then. Let's just see which path we can go to next. I will just like figure something out, maybe from this very beginning decision and stuff like that. I mean, I think we really have dawn, 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 dawn. And this is where it starts, like right here. This is where the reverse lie starts. And this is where we only like see Yuri's path and everything. So I think the actual uh, thing that I will do is be li like right here. I will choose not to be Yuri's um, 
like uh, teacher like who's helping him with, uh, with 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 homework and stuff this his tutor oh, man, it's getting a little bit loud outside so yeah I will definitely like choose not to be his tutor and see where but where, where the next and what the next ending would be because I'm sure that this is the choice to go onto Yuri's path I don't know how much. How, oh man, I have no idea what I'm talking about anymore. But so far as I know, that Lee and his family has something to do. I don't know if his family is actually the organization, and I don't know. I mean, we still have to figure out what, what, um, what Rico said about his last wish and about Clifford and his past and about the white. Um, about Shu Shun Ziang was it, and about everything because, oh man, so many things to find out. But we'll definitely get to it in the next part of Let's Play Doppelganger. And for now, I thank you all for your support and for watching, of course. And let's see each other in the next part of Let's Play Doppelganger. Until next time, guys. See ya.